What's up guys? Just giving you guys a walkthrough of my kayak. This is the Pelican Pitch 120. You know I have dry storage. Nothing much but a lot of my electrical, my battery box, which this battery box will go in there. I got the uh, tracks, my paddle holder. I thought I probably wouldn't use them, but I use them quite a bit. And that's where my fish finder mounts to. I have the pad. It helps me when I stand up in case I slip. I have the banding branches, classic angler. Really light compared to the cheap one that I bought. Got a Scotty mount. I have more Scotty gear track mounts. You know, overall the seat. I actually just made this. It's a little pouch, put stuff in the back. Two rod holders. Another track over here. I should have put a smaller one, but what's done is done. It holds my rear camera mount. Oh, the trailer. There's my crate. You know, simple stuff. Anchor. Tackle. I don't I try not to carry that much a lot of tackle when I'm on the kayak. I actually cut the bottom of another crate, put it on top, and just zip tied the back of it together. It's my anchor pole. About eight foot long. It's pretty good. Not too bad. Honestly, the only thing about this kayak is the tracking, but depends on how you how well you can paddle. But the stability of it is awesome. I mean, I tried tipping it a lot of times and it just doesn't want to tip over. I bought it originally for five hundred and fifty dollars, so not bad. Just simple stuff. I removed all my stickers. I felt like it was just too many stickers, so I have two stickers on it right now. Mm. I don't think there's anything much I'll do to it. I think this is probably the most I'll do to it. I mean, it looks complete already. I mean, they don't make paddle drives, so they don't make paddle drives for the Catch 120, so, I mean, I have my trolling motor set up and stuff, but it seems like just too much work to put everything on. Why take a long time to set, set it up when you could be out there fishing already, right? Alright guys, just a tour of the kayak. Some updates. Oh, and uh, I did put some noodles underneath I should have done that in the beginning just so it could sit on it and it wouldn't warp the kayak seems to be working fine as of right now alright guys stay tuned